The frontrunner to be Italy's next prime minister could spell trouble for the country's relationship with the European Union. The far-right Brothers of Italy party, led by Giorgia Meloni, is expected to get the largest vote share in Italy's election on Sunday. Meloni will lead a coalition of other right-wing parties, led by four-time Prime Minister Silvio Berlusconi and former Interior Minister Matteo Salvini. Giorgia Meloni started in politics 25 years ago. Still a teenager, she joined the Italian social movement, an extreme right party inspired by Benito Mussolini's fascists. Just 19, Maloney described Mussolini as a good politician because, according to her, everything he did, he did it for Italy. From her neo-fascist beginnings, Maloney joined the National Alliance and served as children's minister under Silvio Berlusconi before founding the Brothers of Italy party in 2014. Brothers of Italy are right-wing, nationalist, eurosceptic and fiercely anti-immigration. Maloney has previously argued that Italy should ditch the euro and that Italian law should be given priority over EU legislation. Her government would mean a serious shift in Italy's position in and on the European Union. They say that Europe is a bit worried about Maloney and what will happen with her. What will happen? The fun will be over. What will happen is that Italy will be able to defend its national interests. In response to Maloney's Euroscepticism, Italy's former Prime Minister and leader of the centre-left Democratic Party, Enrico Letta, has said that moving away from the EU could spell the end of Italy as we know it and that a Maloney government could be a destructive force in Brussels. I think that if the right wing were to win in Italy, it would be a big problem for Europe. There's never been a big European country led by political forces clearly opposed to the community idea of Europe and clearly in favour of a Europe of nations with a right to veto. But Meloni's supporters are clear that her party's Eurosceptic stance is part of its appeal. Giorgia Meloni. I think Giorgia Meloni is one of the few people who can stand up to Europe. Above all, I believe she will hold Italy up. L'Europa. As the EU is looking to expand its power and bring in new members from Balkan countries to Ukraine, Brussels may be up against a new powerful Eurosceptic force at the heart of the Union. In the past few months, the European Union has been struggling with the fact that just one of its smaller member states, Hungary, hasn't been aligned with the bloc on foreign policy or energy decisions. A Maloney victory would mean that for the first time ever, one of the EU's six founding members is led by a Eurosceptic government. This kind of resistance by one of the EU's most powerful members is likely to cause an almighty headache for the European Union.